President Mueller. I am uh, so excited to be here on this campus. Um, I've watched it grow over the years, but this is my first time here. And now I see why kids are so excited to attend this college. Yeah, you know, when we came here 13 years ago, there were 900 students on this campus. And when we start this fall, there'll be just under 25,000 students on this campus. So the growth has been remarkable. Phoenix is a destination city and Arizona's a destination state. And, and Arizona's never had a prominent private Christian university. And so in some ways, this has kind of been waiting to happen. Yeah, and you said the amount of kids that are gonna be here, but it seems like a bigger roar because you hear so much about the graduates. You hear so much about the programs you have here. You hear about the sports that you guys have been just amazing at. You know, it's, we've been very blessed. We have now 20 advisory boards with over 500 companies represented on those advisory boards. Most of them are, are there because they want our graduates. Uh, in engineering, computer science, information technology, pre-med students, nursing. Uh, and so people have recognized that, yeah, academically we're doing very, very well. Kids are very well prepared. But the faith element does add a lot from a character perspective that's attractive to employers. Yeah, and you said right there the faith uh, that these kids have. And we were talking before we started our, our little talk and walk here about how proud kids are to continue their faith here at this school. Because some of them were a little worried when they were looking at other universities because that's been their, their grounding at home. And they wanted to make sure they had that grounding at a college. Yeah, they don't want it to be something that's just kind of on the periphery or maybe it was there in the past. They want it to be real and they want to live it out while they're here. Uh, and, and so they do while they're on our campus. But then we're in this very needy community. It's 45 different languages spoken within five square miles of this place. There's a lot of immigrants here. And our reach into the community is something that they're very proud to participate in. It really has become kind of the brand of the university. Yeah. Also, it's not just about the students who are coming here to continue their faith. It's those who might be just coming in for looking for a great educational background that eventually find their faith here. It happens a lot. You know, probably 30% of our students come here for without faith in their background, and we welcome them here. We want them to share their worldview. Uh, they know that we're going to teach from a Christian worldview perspective. If they have a different worldview perspective, we want them to share it. But a lot of them are influenced by our students and they eventually want to hear more about their faith and, and their worldview and, and uh, they may show up at chapel, they may go to one of the Bible studies and so that happens a lot. Yeah, okay, I see you smiling here because one is that you have amazing college here that has been breaking myths about smaller colleges and that is the technology, that is the advance that you guys have here because everyone thinks it happens at the bigger university but here you smile because you walk around seeing these soon to be doctors, soon to be uh, major you know, computer wizards and stuff right here and everyone kind of like says, well, it's a small college, come to our big one, but you have it right here for them. Yeah, you know, and, and, and that's, there's not many places students can go uh, to a Christian university and have a major university experience. Um, you know, we've, we started out with 900 students. We'll have 25,000 students when we start this fall, and we're going to build it out to 40,000 students. And so one of the things that's very attractive is that you can come to a Christian university. You can become part of a tight-knit community, but you can have a major university experience with Division I athletics, the seventh-ranked campus in the country in terms of classrooms, laboratories, residence halls, uh, 32 restaurants, uh, five pools, five fitness areas. And so uh, it's a major university campus campus that's, that's ranked very high, it's very new and it's very modern, but it also has the very tight-knit community that they're used to at some of their the high schools they came from. Yeah, well they're always enrolling, always having, uh, again, tours, all kinds that you come to come and see GCU and you have to as we like to call it, but it's Grand Canyon University. Information is right there on the bottom of the screen for you to, of course, continue your education or your, or your kids. You never know, they take, of course, master classes, all kinds of things going on here. So uh, we got more where you're coming up after this.